What's up guys? This is Mad Squash924. Welcome back to some Fallout 3, where we have been investigating the incident of Grey Ditch, where Squash has found there's been a lot of ants that have taken over this whole entire town. And um, we rescued a child in the middle of Grey Ditch, and he brought us here to, well, more or less brought us to Great Edge to then discover that in the metro, in this metro tunnel, um, stuff has been going down. We met with a scientist, and then from there, we, um, okay, there's somebody on, but, but um, from there, we, uh, basically, uh, just, you know, been killing ants. But, um, we're gonna go and start right back up with our, with a uh, role-playing as Squash, and, um, well, here we go. Okay, guys. Let's uh, let's see what there is to see. Creepy door. Um, it's, I guess this is where the Ant Queen lays dormant. And um, the scientists did say there was other thingies in here, other ants. Let's see what we find. And it's so dark, I can't see a thing. Hello. That one, ant refuse pile. There's definitely ants in here. Kind of nervous. What are you? The one of the guardians. We've been. Them. They, whoa! My goodness. This is pretty rough. Shit. Fire! Is that another ant behind him? I really hope not. Um, eat this ant meat. Um, let's use a med axe. Uh, from there. Oh, damn. I forgot how low on ammunition we actually really are. Uh, keep shooting them in the dome. Hopefully we, we take them out. The scientists gave us a job and we will do it till the end. Wasteland is no joke. I should have stayed in the vault instead of coming out here. What can you do, right? Uh, let's pull out some mines. Hello? Alright, let's keep going. Not the Guardian. Hopefully this just takes care of the problem. He's frenzied. Come on. Jeez. Look at how many stim packs we actually have. We have a, quite a bit of them. Um. There it is. Just another guardian, it is. All right. Come on, buddy.
Very good. Sorry, ants, but uh, you've been killing too many people. And I'm a people guy, you know? What's this? Nothing? Okay. Hello? Hello? The scientist sent me? Oh, this one's really hurt for some reason. Or not. Come on. What are they doing? Oh no! We were told not to hurt the queen. Uh oh. Come along, my young friend. Come on. Oh. What? Where's the rest of the mines? Oh. Actually, let's go for the brain. Yeah. Right, good. Come on. Stop being that way, you guy. Gotcha. Ugh. All right. We made all five nest guardians from the ant hatchery. And we did that without actually hurting the queen. I mean, we didn't hurt the queen. Um, but he did. I guess we go back. Do not harm the ant queen. Okay. Let's make sure I don't have any mines left around. I don't think so. Okay, I think we're good. The scientists will be very pleased of our success. Um, yeah, I'm very, very happy. Hopefully they'll stop threatening all these people. I mean, I, I don't want these ants to go and start killing everyone. I kind of, I think I should turn up the brightness a bit. It is very dark. Especially for you people at home, because YouTube does make things even darker than than it actually does. Well, than here, where I'm, at, where I am. So, back to Marigold Station we go. I have done my job. I've helped better humanity. I hope. Let's see what the scientist has to say of our great deed. Hello, I have returned. I assist you in your endeavors. I don't, um, sir, I don't know, but, uh, I did the thing. some changes within the Queen's hatchery with my equipment. What's transpired? Well, um, I, I did what you told me to go out and, and do. I, uh, I killed the Guardians without harming the Queen. Now, I mean, the Queen did get hurt. I didn't kill the Queen. Um, I actually shot some of the antenna. By shot, I mean, some mines blew up in his face right and based off from that um the the queen was very distraught with me and um some of her kin so yeah but well, she's fine oh how marvelous please tell me what happened i i just did i, I killed on the nest guardians Aren't, weren't you listening then i will proceed to my portable terminal at once and make the necessary changes to the formula thanks Good. very much for everything you've been quite a useful lab assistant Thank you. Um, you know, I am, I, what, what should I do with, um, young Brian Wilkes? He's, he's just chilling at Great Edge and I don't know what to do with you him. You should take him away from this place. Find him a home. It would oh. be difficult to accomplish my experiments with him scampering about and asking an interminable amount of questions. I, right. 
you're right. Um, yes. Um, I know. I I guess I'm ready for this muta mutagenic bio enhancer injection, sir. Um, I'll take it. How marvelous! Which injection did you want? Will it be the ant site or ant? Uh huh. I don't know. I guess um. This will increase our physical strength or our perception. So let's see here. What what would what would I want as squash? I guess um, the bee have a little bit more perception would be nice. How marvelous! And sight it is. Hold still, please. Uh, yes, sir. Is that is that uh, sterile? Uh, ow, dude. Ant sight perk added. You have been granted the perception and flame resistance of the Great Ditch Fire Ants. Your perception has increased by one, and you are now 25% resistant to fire. Thank you! Sir? Thank you. Um, I'm just gonna go now. I... You just knocked shit off? Okay, I'm just gonna pretend I, I, it was me. I, I must have been the one that did that. Uh, yeah. Okay. We've we've actually helped somebody. It's a first step into being a helpful man. Well, I've become a scientist like my father before me. Oh, wonderful! More ants. Aha! Foolish ants! We have evolved into a higher being. However, the fire and the flames still very much hurt me. Ow! Where's the antenna? Well, that's not good. We need to get better with with weapons. Owie. This really hurts. Um I guess I'm gonna have to kill him with the baseball bat. I'm gonna have to knock you out, ant. This won't hurt at all. Come on! Oh! Okay. Whew. I think I, I think I got him. It's more ants. I hear them. What does that quest say? Return to Brian? Yeah, we'll do that. I, I just figured we might as well just finish exploring this actual, you know, place. Jump you! Haha! I become more powerful than you, Ant! Haha! If I jump, you will never stop me! Oof! That's one way to take care of some ants. Father would be very proud of us. He'd be like, son, I brought you into this world. Don't make me regret it. I'm pretty sure he'd say something like that. What we got? Plunger. We have no such need of plungers in our establishment. We are in still search of that key, however. The key to um, what I believe is to be to a safe that we read in a note last episode, if you guys do remember that. So we need to find that. Squash is searching very hard. Hello? Uh oh. I 
I've learned the power of jumping. Is that it? Um, I guess either way works. Let's check this door. Oh! Grady's safe key! That's actually exactly what we were searching for. Um, now we can actually go forth and open that thingy up. Psycho stem pack. An ammo box. How lovely. Carton of cigarettes. We don't smoke. It's not healthy. Um, I do recall where that stuff is, so let's just go back to where that is. Let us go forth and open Grady's safe and see what Grady has been hiding from us. It'll be great. It'll be lots of treasure. I don't remember exactly what he said was in that safe, but I remember it was of great importance to him to the point where he lost his life over it. Therefore, we will do it in the name of Grady. Grady! Alright, here's the lights. And it was in here. Here's the safe. Oh. That was it? Okay. That's, that's I'm only gonna ask Who the hell you are this you? one time. Give hey. me the naughty nightware. What? What? Uh, who the hell are you? Uh Uh, how about you do okay fine it's fine okay you don't you need to hear you don't you, there's no need for violence um i just don't i just don't want to be um attacked you're not a raider are you you have raider clothes yeah on. that's what i thought now scram oh uh, you stole my naughty, naughty nightwear it's time for me later. to go later bye guy yeah yeah just keep on walking i can't tell if you're a raider or not you feel like you give off raider vibes by your clothes, but you have a name named Lugnut. Yeah, yeah. Just keep on walking. But I would. That's that's terrible. I would never kill somebody over something so stupid as naughty nightwear. To be fair, I didn't really want it. The man did scare me. If uh, the game, it's that's the second time that a man has come and jumped down in front of us. And nearly scared me half and half to death. Um, of course, if the game didn't stop me, I would have blown his brains out, and that would have been very awkward, considering I've never hurt a soul other than animals and raiders. Of course, he kind of looks like a raider. I wonder if he was one. He had a name. He, his name wasn't Raider, so I, I guess I can give him off the hook. Oh. Hello! Little anti boy. If I just keep jumping around you, you can't hurt me. Come on! We have done it. Wonderful. I think upbringing the brightness was the right choice. For sure, though. We couldn't see, like, anything. At least I couldn't. Let us get out of here and we'll tell Brian what of our, our accomplishments. Um, we're gonna have to find him a new home, too. I don't know where we're gonna bring him. Quite frankly. But I hope he'll like his new home. Ah, there's the exit. We're coming for you, Brian. We'll come back, young child, and hopefully help you. Um, I really don't like leaving the children out there just because, you know, it'd be, it'd be terrifying. Imagine if my father left me if I was his age. I'd be dead. I would never make it. Overseer would kill me, and Amada would have to see my corpsey face. Oh, I shudder at the thought. Mary Gold Station. Quite a lovely place. Quite bright, in fact.
Is this what I think it is? It is. Okay. Can we fix that in any way right now? We cannot. No big deal. Just carry us. Brian, we're coming back for you. Um, we have we have dealt with the ant problem. They shall no longer harm you. Well, be as What's a nuisance as they once were. What are you looking at in there? Hey, Brian, I'm back. It was so weird. All of a sudden, the ants went nuts and started fighting each other. It was like That's very, they were totally crazy. Very odd. It was really scary, but kind of cool at the same time. You know what I mean? Yeah, um, that was because of me. I, I did that. I, I was the cause of that. I'm, I am glad you're safe, but I was the cause of that. I wish I had something to give you for all the work you did. But I that never was really had much to start with. I guess now you'll be on your way, and I'll have to try living here by myself. I hope you'll come back and visit someday. Well, I, I don't think I can just leave you here. That'd be very, very rude of me. Um, maybe I can find you a new place to live. Maybe I can... Maybe Megaton. Maybe... Do you want to go to Megaton City, perhaps? I mean, that's an option. That's the only town I know of other than the vault, and my overseer is crazy at the moment, so we don't want to go to the vault. Really? You mean it? Sure. Oh, boy. Thank you so much. I'll wait in my old house for you to come back. I need to bury my papa anyway. Just don't forget about uh, well, me. Yeah, that's fine. Um, do you have any ideas where um, someone perhaps may take care well, of you? Papa always told me about my cousin Vera. She lives in some big giant ship somewhere or something. Papa called oh. the place Rivet City, but I don't Rivet know where City. it is. Never heard of it. Well, um, I'll keep an eye out if I end up finding this rivet city. I'll, I'll ask Vera and confirm with her if she can, if uh, you can live with I her. I wish you could stay here with me in Grey Ditch. I, I rather not, honestly. Um, I'm surprised you're even willing to stay here. I'm surprised you don't want to go to Megaton. It's a great place. The, I mean, there was a bomb there, but you know, I did take care of it. Back on the mission at hand. We do have to do things for Moira, of course. She did tell us about the mole rats. We have to use the repellent on them. That was a, quite a sidetrack that we um, that we went on, but nevertheless, it was probably for the best. And now we're off in search of greater, better things. I am glad we helped the young lad. Of course, we still need to find this rivet city he calls home. By calls home, I mean he wants to he wants it to be his new home, but we we have not the location of where that could possibly be. It's unfortunate. It's quite odd that I talk to myself quite frequently as I run through the wasteland, talking to myself in the third person here and there. Yes, quite odd. Oh, mines. Well, this feels like an, a familiar thought. Let's just, uh, save. Okay. Okay. Uh-oh. Ow! My arm! I broke my fucking arm! Ow. Stupid mines. Who would put mines in such a precarious place? Perhaps it's work of raiders. They seem to be popping up all over the place as of late. I really hope it's raiders. I just want to put this gun right in their throat. Memorial facility. Is that the place where we need to go? I'm not sure. Test the repellent and seven more more rats. Okay, um, I'm not sure if this is where we're supposed to go. Let's check our map. Uh, I don't think so. We could explore it. What is that thing? That thing's disgusting. I didn't die. Nope. 
I'm not having any of that. Not today. Not for me. No, 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 no. Wow. Anchorage War Memorial. Those are some impressive statues. Very impressive, actually. Who would have thought? I wonder why we all went to the vault. I mean, I heard it was because of the nuclear war, and I guess the shows. But, oh well. Brad Roach. Brad Roach. Meyer work. That's what they're called. That's what they are. Well then. Good thing we don't have to deal with that. We should probably put on the, re the repellent at this point in time. Considering Moira. Ah, get out of the water. Oh, jeez. Let's go in the sewers. Hello? Is there any um, mole rats here? I know what you look like if they are here. Let's, uh, let's take this nice and easy. I mean, this is just a repellent. It's not going to hurt them, which is great. Um, we'll be able to take care of the mole rat situation forever. Okay, we're going to have to beat them. Oh my goodness. This isn't just a repellent. It's a, it's a murder pellant. Well, I, I do have to test them out on more of these beasts and creatures. Wow. I mean, we could return to Moira, or we could see about more of them. And we are an overcheer, overcheer for Moira. Overcheer, over a cheaper. That's the word I'm looking for. Uh, Moira. Moira, I would love to talk to you if I could right now, but you're not here. If she was here, what would I say? That her... Her... Thing works, I suppose? Her thing, her invention? It does work. However, it works a little bit too well. I would say, in fact, this is, um... Distasteful in some manner, speaking. Turret control system... I cannot read. What was that? It was a person. There's a turret. Hmm. How does one solve an issue? Eh. I think I took out Raider Leg Crippled. I can't believe there's Raiders in here. Well then. That's great. I'm gonna kill them with every fiber of my being. Hello, raiders. Raiders, I have some raiding to do on you. You sick little bastards. Hey there. Oh, it's a mole rat. I killed it, and it's innocent. Mole rats and raiders coalescing and existing in one harmonious sewer system. Privy the thought. Hello? Ah, an assault rifle. Who would try? You would. Come on. Come on. Oh. That's much better. Oh, that feels so much better to skin that out of my system. They do have to die. Mole rats, bodies. Hello. Oh. Well then. I'm glad they're donating their bodies to science. The science that Moira needs. Hello. Oh. Stick is quite deadly and effective. Wonderful. What else is here? What can we search here? 
and this sewer system. Hello? More ratties? Are you here? Well, you are. And so are you. I don't recall killing any of you. In fact, I don't think I did. I wonder if there's more raiders in here. Hmm. This lead back to where I think it goes? To the terminal? Yes, it does. Wonderful. Just making sure. I don't want to get lost. Um, well, we definitely know there's raiders here. How many more of these beasties do we have to do? On seven more? Shit. Well, that's not going to work that way. Somebody down here has been killing all the mole rats. I only have to test them for science. Mines. Oh, what fun. What are you? Oh! Rock Salt is your name. Ah! Ow! You just shot me in the fucking shoulder! You bitch! You're not gonna touch me, Raider Filth. You're just hideous in all the right ways. Well then, since bullets don't seem to work on you, we're gonna have to do this the right way. Raider, come here! I have a present for you! Oh, I know, it's quite lovely. Come here. He's dead now. A key. Okay. I'm glad I got that on my system. Surely there's no more. Right? That'd be preposterous. We are finding quite a bit of mines. To say the least. Not many. Ooh, more mines. Thank you. We are starting to learn this place inside and outwards, though. Which is quite lovely. There's more mines over there. More rats? Oh, that's really awkward. You're a raider. I'm going to kill all of you. I'm gonna... yeah. Come here. Oh. Come here! I hate your kind so much. Why is this doing like no damage? Does this. How much damage does this do? Four. What does my normal pistol do? Five. Why am I not using the normal pistol? <gasps> Oh, that's why, because it's out of ammo. Of course. Let's just fix that real quick, and then we'll switch to this. Where'd you go, Raider? I have a present for you. Damn Raiders. I hate your kind with a passion. Oh, it's too late for you. You're gonna die here. And it will be lovely. What if I use the shotgun on your dome? Hello, Hello Raider. Oh, you should. I guess you really shouldn't be pillaging and killing. Ah, <laughs> oh. the sweet release of death upon your shoulders. This feels I'm lovely. Sorry. I was just playing. I swear. Oh, you were playing? Here's the thing. Playing doesn't involve a shotgun. Thank you, sir. Your contribution was added to my collection. 
Well then. Jeez, I need to get out of killing people. This is, uh... It's quite stressful. I really wish I don't have to kill more people, but... The raider situation is huge. Never thought there'd be so many raiders in my life. And they all have to go. They are, of course, my ultimate nemesis. The raiders. A footlocker has a... I mean, has pretty well money in it. Okay, I see you. All these things that they've stolen. It's quite sad, I haven't seen any other mole rats. Now we check that. Is anyone else out here? I really hope so. Because I hate your kind, Raider scum. Hello? More mines. It's a mine! More mines. A poor mole ratty. Who would have thought they'd kill more mole rats? Hello? Mole rats! Ah. Oh. Thank you for being here. I, I really need to spare my more on you, apparently, because Moira is a glutton for your punishment. Oh. Unfortunately, you are only animals, and so therefore, you don't have morals. So, you could, that's why you have to go. I mean, at the end of the day, I need to eat. I'm sure you, you all know. We did it. We tested them out. Now what else is here? We might as well finish exploring these ruins of a sewer. Well, nothing's in there. Who would have thought? Hello? Hello? That sounds like raiders. And I love to kill raiders with a beautiful heartfelt passion of mine. Ah! Ah. All right, let's go. Raiders? Please tell me you're raiders. You are raiders. Oh, that's so lovely. Goodbye. Oh. You survived the shots to the dome. But can you survive two shots to the dome? The answer was not. Oh. Owie. How dare you take the tactic of the ancient which involves me killing you and making sure your head disappears from your body as all raiders must go and suffer for spike knuckies big guns hm. we don't need such things key key we have a key wonderful uh, there's a paint gun, and I hope it kills people with paint. I never heard of such a concept, but such a concept is also not known to me if that is the case. A power fist. Wow. I never heard of such a fist that contains so much power in my life. Whiskey. Disgusting. They're alcoholics! I'm too young to drink. I'm only 19 after all. Since I just escaped the vault and everything. But that bit were to drink. 19 would be a good age. But I don't. I digress. More raiders! Raiders! Are you around and about? I would love to murder you so coldly in blood. If only because you are so heartless in your own sense of the imagination. Raiders! I have come for your soul! Because apparently you love taking mole rat souls without using the repellent. Oh, mole ratties. I've come for your souls ah. using the repellent, as I was told to do so. See? I'm a good soul. At least I do my job that I am being paid for. 
Of course, I will try my best not to kill a person out of good intent. Because uh, I like helping people. But man, I hate raiders. They gotta go, you know? I keep saying this because I'm crazy. It's totally and utterly insane. Probably because my father's dead, I imagine. Maybe he's alive and I just don't know it. Either way, I hope he's alive and well. I need to find him after all. Ah, scrap metal. Walter would love that. More scrap metal for Walter. Walter, he's going to be so pleased with me. Which I'm very excited for. Walter's a good guy. He knows what needs to be done. He knows the important things uh, in Megaton. Like, making sure the water is good. What's in here? Hammers. Wonderful. A sledgehammer. Very heavy. I dare not. Scrap metal. Um, we can make a bottle cap mine, I suppose, but um, we mustn't. Because we don't have the right materials. In case one is asking. Of course, I'm by myself. I'm crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just hope my father never has to learn of what I've had to done to so many beautiful animals. Hello? There's no raiders, is there? I really hope not. That leads to the outside world. And this leads to the underground city of the Breland. The Breland is such a place of high potential. Let's go to Metal Gate to Georgetown. What's in Georgetown? Who knows? Hello? Is this Georgetown? Where are we? Georgetown. Hmm? Well... Let us go back to simpler times. Times where there was no enemies nearby. There's enemies everywhere, apparently. And I'd rather not fight any beings of helpfulness. I'm sure they're helpful. I don't like killing individuals that are good caused. Alright. How about now? No? What is here? Hello? Hello, sirs? Mrs? You're not raiders, are you? I'll kill you if you're a raider. I really hope they're not raiders. That'd be terrifying. Hello? Oh, Nuka Cola Quantum. And some Snickies for us. Hello? I don't want to hurt anyone. I'm just here to. What are you? He shot. Oh, it's that thingy again. I'm oh. sorry. <laughs> Look, I didn't have to. I didn't want to have to kill you. No! I'm getting shot by all angles. I, I'm I'm sorry. I didn't I didn't mean to interrupt anybody here. Well, this is gonna be um, hard to explain. Well, let us start with my opener. A centaur. I've never heard of such a creature. Well, I don't want to have to hurt them, so I'll do my best. Sir, I'm sorry. Stop, please. You're, why are you so damn big? You're a monster. Oh, jeez. They know the art of combat. Ooh. Owie. That's okay. I'm just going to knock you out. I'm going to have to knock you people out. Yeah. Yeah. Eh. You gonna eat my arms? 
Okay. Okay. Whew. I've swung this thing so much before. Ah, my father gave me this baseball bat. Oh, I will not show you mercy. Well, I mean, I will show you mercy. Please stop, sir. Oh. Okay, let's just relieve you of your weapons. I don't want you hurting anyone else. Oh. Oh. Okay. Again, don't I don't want you guys hurting anybody, so I'm gonna have to take your weapons away. Oh. I don't know what a super mutant is, but that's what they were called. It says it on his chest piece. Well then. Wherever you are. <laughs> Look, I'm gonna have to put you to sleep because you guys won't leave me alone. Hello? Sir. You can't I won't. Hide from me. I I, well, I'm not here to hide. I'm here. I'm gonna have to put you to sleep. You guys can't be hurting innocent people. It's. It's disgusting. <laughs> stop. Stop. Please stop, sir. I don't want to do this. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Whew. They're just sleeping. It's fine. Oh, I'm fat. Let's um let's fix some things. Like my baseball bat that my father gave me. Um, what else should we do? All right. Well, we did what we set out to do. Which is... Um... I don't know what we were here to do. I didn't want to have to hurt anyone, but, uh... Ended up being the case. Oh, a baseball bat. I'll put that to good use. Stealth boy. Ooh, a gun like the Barbarian. I didn't know they were fans. Man, we had so much in common. I wish I didn't have to knock them out. unfortunate well we did it let's head back to megaton since there's nobody here coming to hurt us now moira will be most pleased with us i i'm sure oh man we're back it's late but we are back evening hello you looking to trade stranger check out crater side supply I'm, I'm, I would talk to Moira, but she's closed right now. Let's see, let's see if shit what the sheriff has to say if he's home. Sheriff, are you home? Hello. L Lucas? Lucas? I'm back, sir. Um, Lucas? Hello? Oh, hello, Lucas. Boy, I'm just here for something in your house. That thing is truly dead. Yeah, I have heard this was in your house. You found a vault -Tec limited edition bobblehead. The inscription on the base reads, It's essential to give your arguments impact. Your strength has been permanently increased by one. All right, Lucas, uh, I, I'm, I, that's all I was here too. I was here to relieve you of your bobblehead. I mean, I know your kid doesn't need them. I just, I, I like collecting them. I'm a, I'm a slut for... For bobbleheads. See you later. Hey. Hey, what's up, girl? We're we just chilling. All right. To our home, where we'll take a good nap. I've been resting in quite some time. Wonderful. All right, we got some pre-war books in there. All right, what do we not need that we can just put away in here? I can take this out, I guess, and just fix it up. So let's do that. 
Still don't have any ammo for it, so let us go and put it away. Scope thingy. Uh, this one. Here we go. A power fist. We'll put that in there. Lots of mines we don't need. Um, we can keep 10 on our person, I think. I think after coming back here, having 10 was probably sufficient. Just always have 10 of each thing. What else? Probably could sell these assault rifles to Moira. I'm sure she'd be pleased to hear about them. Environmental suit. Might need that. Pre-war money. Oh yeah, Walter. Walter would be very happy to know what we have for him. Hello, well Wadsworth. They are. They are. Very much so. We have to go take a long nap. <sighs> mm. Long day. It's been a long day for us. We uh, went to Great Etch. We we saw the crime of the giant, disgusting-looking ants. Welcome home, sir. I've been home, Wadsworth, for another for 12 hours. Uh, I must be going. Well, it's good to be home. Yep, home sweet home. That's quite nice living here. I mean, we have to find our father, but I suppose he can wait for a little while. A little while longer. Walter, are you home? Hope he's in work this early. I mean, it's only eight. I'm sure he's home. There he uh, is. Huh? Yeah, what is it? Um, your vampire eyes are showing. Um, other than that, I was here to give you some scrap metal. I sure am, Sonny. What have you got for me? You know everything. Uh, just just take it all. I mean, I don't, in fact, just have it. I don't I don't even need any money. Are you serious? Why? Yeah. I'll be. Thank you, stranger. I'm here to help you. I can't tell you what this means to Megaton. Absolutely. I'm just here to help you, well, man. Back to work. All right. I'll talk to you later. If I find more scrap metal, I'll I'll know where to go. I'm sure Moyer will be very pleased to know what we've done. Good morning, Moira. Oh, I can't wait to hear how the repellent's working. Oh, it worked wonderful. Um, I mean, I, I tested the mole rat repellent very extensively, if I must say so myself. Oh, excellent. Substantial field testing, precise reports, and such dedication. <laughs> what more could I ask for in a research assistant? So, get how did my chemical repellent work? Safe and clean like a charm, I'll bet. Yes, most, most definitely. Um, look. I, I, I didn't, I don't think it's as, as non-lethal as you were expecting. Um, that's putting it lightly. In fact, they kind of, um, blew up to a point where they, uh, after the second swing, they just don't live anymore. In fact, their head goes away. Other, um, other than that, down there, there were some raiders. I, I took care of them. You know, doing the good work. I killed raiders. You know. I mean, of course, you know that. We've we've already discussed the mall. What we happened at the mall. I hated them. But, other than that, yeah, that's that's what happened. Oh, dear. All of them? Yeah, well, all of them. I don't think I could water down the formula any further. With that much testing, I guess it's beyond correction. <sighs> eh, go ahead and keep it. Maybe you can find a nicer use for it, right? Oh, but for right. your trouble, uh, uh, here, have the leftover chems from working on the repellent. I'm sure you can find some use for them. Oh, thank you. Two jets. Wonderful. Two psychos. I'll never use that, probably. Well, the last part of this chapter, you want me to do something about the Myelux, correct? Yes, knowing more about them can help people learn to avoid or even outsmart them. So I picked Good. up this observer device to study them in their natural habitat. I need you to mm -hmm. hide one in one of the spawning pods in their lairs. Wonderful. Okay, so um, I'll, I'll, I'll get right on it. So I'll sneak right in there. Um, I'll try not to kill any, because, I mean, it sounds like you don't want me to disrupt their wildlife, right? That's great. I recommend the nest at the Anchorage War Memorial. I knew a trader oh, who I know where that is. about the Meyerlurks down there. 
just go inside and find one of their spawning pods, probably down near the water. Put this observer inside and get out quietly. And be sure not to oh, okay. kill any Mirelurks inside their nest. If you do, it could ruin the validity of the study. Oh, that's what I was kind of figuring. Um, I will very much not try to hurt them. If they spot me, I will just run and hide as much as I possibly can. Um, other than that, can you, um, can Unless you it's some a of steaming stuff? pile of slag, I'd say yes. Thank you. Now, what do we need fixed? We need some stuff fixed, quite frankly. That, for starters, our armor. Um, what are we even using that we definitely want fixed? I mean, let's fix this up. I don't know if I want to fix that. Um, combat shotgun's fine. Hey, um, can I buy anything from you, too? Oh, do I ever. I've got the schematics for something called a rocket launcher. I sell that all the components, crazy. too, so you can make the weapon yourself. Don't worry Ow. about ammo. This baby shoots all the junk you might find out there in the wasteland. Ashtrays, teddy bears, you name it. In fact, if you ever need to make any custom weapons, feel free to use my workbench here in the shop. All you need is the schematics and parts. Makes sense. Um, but can I start buying some stuff? Sure from thing. You? Thank you. Well, Moira, it's been a day. It's been quite a day. We uh, we need some stim packs, girl. We did end up using a lot of them. In fact, we'll probably need some ammunition as well. We'll sell all these assault rifles to you because, you know, we really don't need them. Bottle cap mine. Yeah, we want these. Okay. We'll sell some of this great stuff to you. Repellent stick I think we'll keep if we see any more um, mole ratties. Hopefully we don't have to... You know what? I'll sell this. This is not as good as I thought it was. Sawed-off shotgun. That uses the same as the combat shotgun? It does. Let's get rid of this. Hunting rifles. We could use. Bottle cap mine. Baseball bat. I do want to keep my baseball bat because I do appreciate a good flat out baseball bat. Oh, but this also uses it. Yeah, we'll get rid of the pistol, I guess. Um, bum, bum, ba, da, da, ba, da, just selling the stuff we don't need. Moira. Selling the Nuka Cola Quantum. At least most of it. Don't need a lot of it. Let's sell a couple of these. Don't need any scotch. No thank you, but thank you for the offer. Um. Jet. I don't think we need any jet. Quite frankly, we're not really a, we're not really drug addicts. Darts could sell darts. Let's do it. Sell a singular missile, some spikes. Sell the spikes. Sell the missile too. While we're at it, I don't really need a missile. Now, what else do you have for actual ammunition? Thirty-two rounds. Yep. Yep. I'll take all those. Yep. Um, in fact, we'll take that too, I think. Thank you. Is there anything else? Probably these. Hmm. Do you have any stealth boys since we're going to be going where we're going? You do not. That's unfortunate. I was kind of hoping you would have some. Well, we could start by... We could get a workbench. We need. I do want the scientist team, Nuka Cola machine. Let's buy a. Uh, do we want any of this stuff? Not really. Yeah, screw good it. Good hunting. I think we're good. Thank you, Moira. Take care. It's a big wasteland, but you know that better than me, right? Yes, unfortunately so. Well, let's go. Well, that's gonna be it for today's episode of Fallout Three. Um. In the next episode, we will go and take care of this Mylurk situation that Moira has set us out to do. Um, ideally, we're not going to kill any of them, since she did request that. So let's go and forth and do that in the next episode. If you liked today's episode, make sure you leave a like, leave a comment. Um, 
Uh, if you're new to my channel or you've watched some of my stuff but you haven't done so already, um, feel free to subscribe to me, Mad Squash924. And don't forget to ring the bell to get notified of my latest videos. And Squash and I will be here where we'll go on our next job. Hope you all have a good day. I'll see you all in the next one.